colorectal or colon cancer overview. What is the colon cancer? Cancer that develop in the colon. Cancer that develop in the colon. Large intestine. Rectum. Among the colon cancer, most common site is sigmoid colon. This is ascending colon, transverse colon, descending colon, sigmoid colon, and anus. The most common site is sigmoid colon. Type of colorectal cancer. 1. Adenocarcinoma begins in cells that inside surface of the colon. This is most common type of the colon cancer. Gastrointestinal stromal tumor begins in the colon wall cells. Carcinoid begin in the hormone producing cells in the intestine. Lymphomas typically begins in lymph node but may also start in the colon. Sarcomas. Sarcomas begins in the muscle cell and connective tissues in the wall of the colon. Nursing assessment. Assess the sign and symptoms. Fatigue. Changes in bowel habits. Special stool changes. Consistency. Consistent frequency. Diarrhea. Weight loss. Constipation. And blood in the stool. Abdominal pain. And abnormal fullness feeling. Assess the lifestyle and risk factors, diet, activity level, smoking, alcohol, BMI level, GI tract disorders, especially ulcerative colitis, Crohn disease. Assess the past treatment history, radiotherapy, chemotherapy, surgery. Do digital rectal examination. Assess the screening and imaging reports, colonoscopy reports, tumor markers, especially CEA reports, full blood count, liver enzymes serum creatinine and biopsy reports. Assess the past medical history, especially medication and family history. Assess the patient psychological status. Treatments for colorectal cancers. Treatments are depend on cancer location, cancer stage, and health issues mainly use chemotherapy radiotherapy and surgery surgery is a primary treatment methods for localized and metastatic colon cancers several types of surgery may be used to treat colorectal cancers Partial colectomy. Remove part of the colon. Remove part of the colon. Called as hemicolectomy. Right colectomy. Ileum is removed. Abdominal perineal resection. Anus rectum and sigmoid colon are removed. Proctosigmoidectomy. Section of the rectum and sigmoid colon is removed. 
total abdominal colectomy. Entire colon removed. Proctocolectomy. Remove all or part of the colon. After surgery, after surgery, attach the remaining colon to the outside of the body. The abdominal wall is it is called as colostomy. Chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is the use of antineoplastic drugs to promote tumor cell destruction. Adjuvant chemotherapy. Give chemotherapy after the primary treatments. Surgery. Used to cancer stage 1 or 3 patients. This method reduces the cancer of recurrent. New adjuvant chemotherapy. New adjuvant chemotherapy. Give chemotherapy before the surgery. This method helps to reduce size of tumor and stop spread. Palliative chemotherapy. Aims to prolong life and improving well being. Folfox chemotherapy. Folfox chemotherapy is used for colon cancers. Folfox is combination of chemotherapy medications. Folinic acid, leucovorine, toluracil, 5-FU, and oxaloplatin. Folinic acid is not a chemotherapy. This is used for give it five few to help it works better. Polfox administer into the bloodstream both IV intravenous direct and use in a cannula. Polfox chemotherapy has cycles of treatments. These cycles of treatments lets 14 days. It could be taken up to 12 cycles. Polfox dose calculate using the special methods. Most important for patient weight and height for dose calculation. Administer three medication before the chemotherapy. Folfox side effects diarrhea, nausea and vomiting, constipation, a number of WBC, RBC, and platelet, anemia, mouth loss, loss of appetite. We can do this intervention for minimize side effects. Nursing diagnosis Acute pain related to damage of mucus layer of the colon and tumor growth. Disturbed body image related to colostomy, loss of control bowel movements, weight loss, and alopecia. Risk for impaired integrity related to stoma and effect of chemotherapy risk for infection related to neutrophenia and decreased immunity fever and anxiety related to further management and fear of death fatigue related to anemia 
Imperial nutrition less than blood requirement related to suppressor appetite and effect of chemotherapy. Example, nausea and vomiting. Dispo, if you dispo, deficit food volume related to dehydration, diarrhea and vomiting. Ineffectivity patterns related to presence of colostomy and changes in body image. Altered bowel elimination related to presence of tumor. Nursing diagnosis number one. Disturbed body image related to colostomy, loss of control bowel movements, weight loss, and alopecia. Goal to support a positive body image. Planning Assess the patient positive and negative attitudes. Reassure the patient. Educate about adaptive behavior, example as use of wigs. Encourage to patient participate in community support groups. Encourage to patient regular routine works. Educate family members about importance of good family support. Implementation Assess the patient positive and negative attitudes. Reassured the patient. Educated about adaptive behaviors. Encouraged to patient participating community support groups. Encouraged to patient regular routine works. Educated family members about imports of good family support. Evaluation to be evaluated later. Nursing diagnosis number two. Imbalance nutrition less than body requirements related to loss of appetite, effect of chemotherapy, example, nausea and vomiting, and abdominal pain. Goal to maintain normal nutritional status and BMI level in normal range. Planning Give mouth care and mouthwash. Example for mouthwash Betadine, Chlorhexidine mouthwash, Aspirin Pechil mouthwash. Monitor weight and maintain weight chart. Administer multivitamin, analgesis, and thematic as ordered. Refer to the patient nutritional unit and arrange diet plan. Maintain input and output chart. Implementation. Give mouth care and mouthwash. Monitor weight and maintained weight chart. Administer multivitamins, analgesis and antiemetic as ordered. Refer to the patient, nutritional unit, and arrange diet plan. Maintain input and output chart. Evaluation. Weight. Input and output with time period. Number three. Risk for deficit fluid volume related to dehydration, diarrhea, and vomiting. Call to maintain normal fluid volume status. Planning. Assess the dehydration signs and symptoms. Oscaldain the patient bowel sounds. Assess the bowel movements, time, frequency, Color. 
administer antiemetic antidiarrheal medication as prescribed promote adequate intake of fluid administer iv fluid as prescribed normal saline 5% exos monitor input and output monitor vital signs implementation assist dehydration signs and symptoms Sculpted the patient bowel sounds. Assist the bowel movements. Administer antiemetics, antidiarrheal medication as prescribed. Promote adequate intake of fluid. Administered IV fluid as prescribed. Monitored input and output. Monitored vital signs evaluation blood pressure pulse rate respiratory rate body temperature no any signs of dehydration nursing diagnosis number four risk for infection related to neutropenia and Decrease immunity. Call to prevent infection. Planning. Educated about how maintain good personal hygiene. Monitor vital signs. Administer antibiotic as prescribed. Administer mucogen. Villagastry as prescribed. Monitor laboratory values. Maintain aseptic techniques during procedure. Clean the stoma and surround of the stoma site daily. Implementation. Educated about how maintain personal hygiene. Monitored vital signs. Administered antibiotic as prescribed. Administered mucogen as prescribed. Monitored laboratory values. Maintained aseptic techniques during procedures. Cleaned at the stoma and surround of the stoma side daily. Evaluation WBC count, RBC count, hemoglobin level, platelet level and CRP level. Nursing diagnosis number 5. Acute pain related to damage of mucus layer on the colon, tumor growth and abdominal pain. Goal to relieve pain. Planning encouraged to use non-pharmacological pain relief methods. Administer analgesis and order. Manage side effects of chemotherapy. Educated the patient about pain management and stress management. Assess the pain level after given analgesis. Use its bath for rectal pain. Implementation. Encouraged to use in non pharmacological pain relief methods. Administered analgesis at order. Educated the patient about patient about. Educate the patient about pain management and stress management. Managed side effect of chemotherapy. Elevation. Pain level. Pain is reduced more than earlier. Today our discussion is over. Like, comment and subscribe our YouTube channel. Give your ideas at comment section. Thank you.